Hey there guys, this is Joe Sloppy Joe Shred Check, and obviously I'm on the road. So guess what? We're doing a vlog. I'm heading down to Appleton, Wisconsin to check out my friend's band, Carnal Ruin, who is coming up to the area from Florida. Needless to say, very excited. say before my name is Joseph definitely click subscribe smash that bell notification and follow me in all of the upcoming videos now if you haven't seen me before welcome to the shred shack it's nice to have you and I like the fact that you're watching this now if you have seen me before welcome back to the shred shack but yeah um, there's a few things I kind of want to talk about I have some things going on in my life that are kind of exciting so fair warning there is going to be a small hiatus on videos um i'm going to be doing this vlog where i kind of just document my trip for funsies also i'll have links in the description box below to carnal ruin spotify their Bandcamp, their facebook instagram whatever you know so those guys are really really cool dudes and they deserve all the attention that they can get but yeah, like I was saying before, um, there's gonna be a shorter hiatus on videos. Why is there gonna be a short hiatus? Well, I can't really talk about it right now, but I'm in the process of recording some music and there's gonna be an application for that music. I will be announcing that in due time, but there are gonna be one, playthrough videos of the music that I record and two there's going to be a reason as to why I am recording the videos in the first place and that will come in a later announcement but needless to say I'm very excited it's a collaboration with another group that's non-music related actually they uh, are an art group of some kind that I'm not going to reveal but needless to say really excited to have that opportunity to be able to record music for them. I apologize about the shaky camera and the weird camera angle, but I'm not about to adjust it, so I'm not too lazy for that. <laughs> but yeah, definitely stay tuned. I got some big things coming up here, or at least big things for me in the grand scheme of Sloppy Joe Shred Shack. Also, just hit 1,300 subscribers yesterday, so that's really exciting. Honestly, um, I didn't even think I was going to get that many subscribers. So, guys, again, thank you for watching my stuff. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing the videos. Honestly, I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you. But right now, honestly, I'm just going to drive. I'm going to shut up here, and we are just going to enjoy the journey. I'm listening to some Porcupine Tree. Great, great driving music. Uh, also, West Montgomery, Death at the Gates. Uh, and recently, I kind of started diving in to the guitar tastes of Chon, Polythia. I've been a Chon fan for a while, but man, there's something about that, that style that I really, really, really enjoy. Um, so I'm getting really interested in that. So on that note, in the comments section below, comment what your favorite driving music is. You know, is it a particular band that you like to listen to when you're driving? Feel free to comment it below. Side note, I um, went and got a new phone because this phone is a piece of garbage. Actually, it's good. Um, this one's a Pixel 2 XL. The reason I had to emergency buy a new phone is because, um, well, uh, the, uh, the charging port stopped working. So hopefully the video quality will get a little bit better for my vlogging. Eh, so who knows? Oh yeah, by the way, I'm in Appleton now, just so you know. Very excited. Very, very excited. 
All right, so I am at the hotel. I am ready with all of my garb, my battle vest as it were. I haven't worn this in a long, long time. Now, if you're curious as to why I am wearing glasses, it's because I have been getting some really gnarly tension headaches. Um, so that kind of sucks. And these glasses are blue blockers and they kind of help with that whole thing there. Um, it, it helps quite a bit. I stare at a screen all day for work. Needless to say, my eyes get pretty strained. Um, but I am really excited to see my pal Tony, who I have not got to visit with in a long, long, long time. And I'm also going to meet his band today, so that's really fun. Now his fiance, Gabs, is also the dopest. So, um, needless to say, very excited. Just kind of sitting around the hotel right now, um, hanging out and doing stuff, you know, mm, whatever. Um, lighting is terrible in here, but it is what it is. I go to the gas station, grab something to drink. Yeah, my head is just killing me right now. So hopefully my ibuprofen will kick in here and, um, you know, it'll eventually go away. I hope, but it's gonna be a lot of loud music. Now, so, something cool that I just purchased, and uh, you know, if guys, if you haven't bought high fidelity ear, like, guys, now something to think about whenever you go to a show, I don't wanna be that dork, but buy some freaking hearing protection. You can get the high fidelity stuff on Amazon for pretty cheap. I'm gonna have links in the description box below. But they usually come in like these little cases and you can keep them on your keychain like I do. But um, yeah, they're they're pretty awesome. I, I really, really like these. So yeah, they kind of look like this, you know, um, when you listen to them, it makes everything quieter, but you don't like lose all the high end and it doesn't make it all muffled. So they're pretty great. Um, like I was saying, links in the description box below. But I am just gonna sit here, hopefully my ibuprofen will kick in, my headache goes away. So to be clear, we are at the pre-show right now. And it's exciting. So there's gonna be two shows tonight. One of this kind of like little DIY place, which is dope. I'm gonna have a little bit of footage there, but I'm gonna capture uh, a majority of the real show at the uh, proper venue, as it were. But enjoy the band. We got Detox. We have Scriptual, who's going to be coming up soon. And then we're going to have some Carnal Ruin. <laughs>
am officially on my way back from Appleton right now. I had a really great time hanging out with my bud Tony. I haven't seen him in a long time, so. Yeah, yeah, sounds great. <laughs> this, this is not here. <laughs> Hi, Tony. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was it was awesome. It's good to see friends, you know. Um, I I really, truly, truly enjoy his company. Also, his fiance Gabs is the coolest. So very excited to see her too. Um, but yeah, uh, the pre-show was awesome. It was at a place called, I think it was called the, the train station. It's a DIY venue. Um, so a band called Retox played, which I obviously have a clip of them there. Definitely go give them a follow and a like on their socials. Uh, Carnal Ruin, you know, played and they slayed it. That was one of the best HM2 death metal bands I have ever heard. And I was telling Tony, like, you know, it's fun that, you know, you have friends that play in like really good bands, but you know, if, even if it wasn't his band, it would be a band that I would be into. Um, fun facts about me, and I don't know if everybody knows this, um, but I really love extreme metal. I mean, obviously I play a lot of clean stuff, you know, and all that, but it, it's a good time. Uh, and then Cryptual played at the pre-show too at the train station and that was amazing that was one of the tightest death metal bands that i've ever heard um they are so good now the cool thing about cryptual is that tony uh the guitar player in carnal ruin when he was still living in the midwest um he made the band cryptual and after he left tampa and made carnal ruin that band cryptual still stayed together and became it's a whole new beast you know like it they are fantastic um that it goes without saying so um very excited to see them after that we went over to a place called misfits tavern which is just little you know like dumpy hole in the wall kind of place but it was really 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 cool it was one of it was just like a little dumpy hole in the wall rock bar man it was it was awesome um so there was a i forgot the band's name i think it's black canvas opened they were like a blackened kind of doom thing i'm not quite sure but it was awesome uh carnal ruin was having technical difficulties at that show so we only got to do part of the set but it still turned out really really good there were some power issues uh, going to Tony's amplifier, so it wasn't quite working the best, but honestly, it still sounded amazing. Uh, and then Cryptual played after them, uh, and then there was another band, and I didn't realize there was another band because I wasn't paying attention, I was getting sleepy, so I took my cameras down, but a uh, band called, uh, I think it's a uh, Court of Beasts, which is a straight up doom band, but like, really really cool doom um links to their socials are going to be down low too um they were super fun um it was like fuzzy doom really really a lot of fuzz pedal worship so that was really awesome uh but the vocalist was just a badass man um so he was doing like this falsetto stuff and like screaming and grunting it was like a really wide variety of vocal sounds but you know they were your doom band 10 minute songs and whatnot but i kind of wish i would have recorded that set because that set was dope um especially if you like really fuzzy doom but uh yeah like i was saying i'm heading back up north now luckily it's nowhere near as snowy as it was um, so that is really, really nice. I mean, obviously we still have a lot of snow on the ground, but there was a snowstorm when I was coming down and that was the worst. I did not like that. It was like 45 miles an hour for about an hour and a half of travel here. But yeah, big, uh, once again, shout out to Carnal Ruin. All those dudes are so nice. You know, I got into a really long conversation with Jared last night, the bass player, and that dude is so cool. I like him. I really like him. But yeah, like, you know, I could go on and on and on and about how all those dudes are dope, you know. Um, but yeah, great guitar playing, great 
you know, drumming and all that. Just old school Swedish, or I call it Swedish death metal because of the Boss HM2 that's being utilized heavily in their recordings. Um, but it's it's awesome. They, they are so good. But regardless, um, like I was saying, you know, uh, I'm going to be taking a short hiatus. I'm going to be posting this video. But in the meantime, I'm going to be doing some recording of my own, doing a collaboration with another group right now. So uh, more to come on that. I'll probably have some stuff posted in the next month or two, maybe a few months. Uh, but stay tuned. It's really exciting. At least I'm excited about it. And again, thank you guys for subscribing and watching, sharing, and posting my videos. Um, I'm very, very grateful for that. I, I can't thank you guys enough as to how great that makes me feel. Uh, I just like the fact that, you know, people listen, and that's awesome. It makes me feel really good. So thank you very much, guys. But anyways, you know, definitely, if you like the content that you're seeing here, click subscribe, smash that bell notification. Follow me in all the upcoming videos. They won't be as shaky as this one. <laughs> but you can also hit me up on Facebook. Just type it into your browser, you turkey. Or hit me up on Instagram at Sloppy Joe's underscore Shred Shack. I'm going to get back to jamming some tunes in my car. But anyways, guys, later.